everybody, Keith Jones behind the binoculars here at Parks for Tuesday, May 14th. The rain finally has moved out of here, but still a very sloppy racetrack under cloudy skies. Let's take a look at races 5 and 6 today. The fifth race, a very interesting bait and special weight at a mile. And we have a big program choice opening up at 3 to 5 as number 3, Compounded, who is coming out for trader George Duarte, making the third career start. He made his local debut here last time out going short. Ran a very good third that day, got beaten just a length, and now for the first time we'll be stretching out, we'll be putting blinkers on, and I think he's going to take uh, some big money here at the windows, the son of Super Saver, of course, Super Saver won his Kentucky Derby over a sloppy track, so compounded, should like the off-going. Uh, the second choice is number four, Vero Sun, who I think is going to also take some money for trader Butch Reed, but I'm going to try the other Butch Reed horse in here, number one, Creative Genius. Now, Creative Genius, in his career debut, came uh, to the race off some good works and was fairly well-backed in his debut. Got off to a very poor start that day and really was not a factor. Now, Creative Genius is the son of Creative Cause, who seemed to have the ability to run all day. So I think Creative Genius is going to enjoy the extra distance here. He also should benefit from the one race under his belt. And again, I think you're going to get a better price on him than either the three or the four. So race number five, let's make it go with number one, Creative Genius. Next pick comes back in race number six, a one-mile claiming racehorse is in here for a tag of $20,000. I'd like number three, two weeks off. Does open up as the program choice here at two to one for trainer Carlos Guerrero. Now, this horse was a $25,000 claim in April of last year. Now, in June of last year, he won for $40,000. And then after a race in December, he took about three months off and came back at that $20,000 level that he's in here today. He got squeezed at the start and also had a very wide trip. And nonetheless, off of the poor trip and off of the time off, still only got beaten by a length and a quarter. And then at his next start, got bumped back down to 16000 and rallied to win convincingly by three that day. Back up the ladder to 20000 today. There's some good early speed in here, so I think he should be able to sit that same kind of just-off-the-pace trip that he had last time out. Has shown the ability to beat this kind of class and even better in the past, and has been sharp of late for trainer Carlos Guerrero, one of our top percentage guys. So race number six, let's make it go with number three, two weeks off. Good luck.